With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, welcome to doubtnet. Our question is, a cylindrical tank has a hole of 1 cm square in its bottom. If water is allowed to flow into the tank from a tube above it at the rate of 70 cm cube per second, then maximum height up to which water can rise in the tank is. So these are our four options we have to find the value of h. So in this question we have one tank and it has a hole at the bottom that has area is equals to 1 centimeter square. Now the water is allowed to flow into the tank from above with the volume flow rate equals to 70 centimeter cube per second. So now if in the tank the water start collecting then it will start leaking from the hole. So let's suppose from the hole the volume of flow rate will be V2. So when the V1 is equals to V2 then there will be constant height in the tank. So we have to calculate that height H. So this we have to Find. So for finding H we have to apply one condition that is volume flow rate 1 is equals to volume of flow rate 2. This is our must condition here. So now for calculating our volume flow rate 2 this can be written as A into velocity where A is the area of that hole and velocity is the velocity of water ejecting from here. This is the value of velocity. So by this method we can write the formula for volume flow rate from the hole. Now we have to first find the value of velocity. So for finding the velocity we have to apply the Bernoulli's equation. So let's suppose in the atmosphere the pressure is P0 and at this point our pressure is P0 plus rho gh. So this pressure can be converted to half rho v square and here also the atmospheric pressure is P0. So if we apply our Bernoulli's equation then P0 plus rho g h is converted to half rho v square plus P0 because outside the hole there is also P0. So from here the velocity comes out to be under root 2 g h. This is the value of our velocity. So we can write the volume flow rate V2 is equals to A into under root 2 g h. So if we apply the condition here V1 is equals to V2 then V1 is 70 centimeter cube per second is equals to V2 is area is given to us that is 1 centimeter square into under root 2 g h. So from here our height comes out to be approximately 2.5 centimeter. So this is the value of our constant height in the tank. So our correct option is option A 2.5 cm. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.